Uh, I'm usually nervous before I perform. You know, I think it would be uh, deceitful to say anything else. You know, you you definitely uh, feel a bit nervous about sharing, especially something that's so you know, intimate and really vulnerable. A lot of my um, pieces deal with sensitive topics or um, grief. And um, you never know how people are gonna react when you're sharing that really personal part of yourself. Um, but once you're, you know, actually out there and you see people, you know, reacting to it in, in surprising ways or in expected ways and, they're th it's really starting to resonate with them it, it really just feeds your spirit and it's it keeps you going I think so um, sometimes it's harder for me to perform in front of one two three people that I know really well than it is for me to perform in front of 150 that I don't really know at all right and um, mostly because I, I respect them as, as storytellers as artists and or as my family members and um, yeah, and I know that they'll read into it more than someone who doesn't know me. So that's something I'm also conscious of is that, you know, the the um, listener or is 50% of of my spoken word. Like every single person that can hear my my work can interpret it differently and it can mean something completely different to them. So it's really interesting to me to hear people's experience you know, when I when I perform for them and what they've taken away and what stands out to them and what they think certain things mean because it's not always what I intended and that's really interesting to me.